In today's video I'm going to be showing you how to create SSL redirects on your own domain for free with Google Firebase. So the first thing you need to do is go to console.firebase.google.com and then you'll need to click on create project. Then you'll need to give the project a name. So in this case I'm going to be redirecting example.applecommunity.net to ridercraigie.com. So I'm just going to call it ac-redirect and then accept the Firebase terms and then click on continue. Here you'll want to disable Google Analytics and then click on create. And after about 30 seconds, you'll see a button that says continue. Click on that continue button and it will take you to this page. The next thing you need to do is click on build at the top left corner and then go to hosting. Then you'll need to click on get started and then click on next, next again, and then continue to the console. And then on the right, you should see a button that says add custom domain. Click on that. And then type in the domain that you want to redirect. And then you need to tick the box below this. And then type in the domain that you want to redirect this domain to. So in this case, it's going to be my own website. And then you can click on the blue continue button. The next thing it's going to do is ask you to add a TXT record to your domain to verify that it's yours. So I'm going to click on the copy value button and then you'll need to go to your domain provider which in my case is Google Domains. So in my case because I'm using Google Domains I'm going to click on manage custom records and then I'm going to choose create new record. So I'm going to leave the host box as it is because it wants us to put it on the root domain so that it can verify the entire domain and I'm going to set the type as a txt record and then paste in the text that Google Firebase gave us into the box on the right and then click on save. So now that that's done we can go back to Firebase and then click on verify and as you can see it's verified it successfully and now it's asking us to point the subdomain which in this case is example to an IP address so that it can actually generate the SSL certificate and redirect it to ridercraigie.com. So I'm going to click on the copy value button next to the IP address and go back to my domain provider and we're going to add a, another record and this time we need to type in the subdomain that we chose originally and then we need to set the type to an A record and then paste in the IP address in the box on the right and then click on save. Now we can go back to Firebase once again and click on finish. So now when you go to that subdomain it will show an SSL error because at the moment it's not generated the SSL certificate but if you click on advanced and then bypass this warning it will redirect to the domain that you chose. Normally it takes about half an hour for it to generate the SSL certificate and your redirect will start working straight away. You can now close out of Firebase and your domain provider and just wait for the changes to take effect. If you wanted to set up a second subdomain you could either create an entirely new Firebase project or you can go back to your original Firebase project and click on add custom domain and then follow the same steps that I went through in this video. If you've got any further questions, please let me know in the comments, and I hope this has helped. Thanks for watching.